Hi lovely people, this is your girl Lufuriwa Dudu here. Welcome to another vlog. It's already new year, so I'm wishing you all a very fruitful year. I pray this is the year that all your dreams get fulfilled. Mm. Oh la la. Lala want to say a happy new year to you all. This morning I was carrying out my usual morning activities so i did some laundry and then i went ahead to check my emails and stuff it was just um, a normal morning that's that's what i do most of the time on days that i have to watch on this particular day i had to meet someone in the morning and that's why you see me in this orange dress um you are going to be fed up with this dress because it's my go-to for quick errands, quack, 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 movements. And so, prepare to be sick of it. <laughs> but every morning, one of the first things I do is to check my emails. I hope you enjoy watching this vlog as much as I enjoyed putting it together. Um, let's see where this vlog takes us. New day, new hair. Who this? <laughs> so, a lot has happened since you last saw me on camera. I was doing some prep stuff in the morning. I went to work and then, guys, I had to do my hair because there's no time. Okay, so I literally had to find a hairstyle that I can do in the shortest possible time. Okay, and so this is what we came up with. I have cornrow in front and then braids at the back. And also, <laughs> guys, I did some make sure I wanted to vlog all that, but there was no time. Literally, when I closed, I had to get the hair, you know, struggling to get to the salon and you know, convincing them to because I got there around four ish, five, thereabouts. Yeah, so um it was a hassle i couldn't vlog all those good stuff but anyway this is the outcome this is not the color i envisioned because i did some combination in my head yeah i'm the chick i'm doing some sick combination but it didn't turn out like i wanted but anyway no problem we move <laughs> now my issue now is fixing my camera in my car i'm not able to get like um a proper position guys adding on let me see not getting like a proper position for uh, yeah let's manage this for a while okay let's manage this for a while see there be that's not the plan it won't work out anyway so um guys i think i have allergies Full now face, with heart -shaped eyes. face blowing a kiss red heart that's my mom calling mama yeah. yes okay. Okay. all right so guys um yeah so let's manage with this for a while i'm trying to move um very carefully so the phone does not fall over but i think i have allergies okay for a while now my smoke is coming my eyes itchy everywhere itchy usually i get irritated around dust so i guess that is what happened and yeah i'm going through it so i called the tema christian eye center i was just trying my luck and they have just few minutes to to close so i'm rushing there quickly to see the optician for an assessment and get some medication because charlie um i don't want to go through christmas with apollo and the resilience apollo is back in season i don't want to be a victim so i need to get that sorted out asap basically this is what i have been up to Christmas. No time. 
I'm always on the run, always. It's like I always have something to do. I don't have time to do anything else. Work, 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 work. Man is tired, oh God. I don't want to continue like this. I just need a soft life. ridiculously difficult to vlog here in Ghana I don't know about other parts of the world uh, let me just limit it to myself it's extremely difficult for me to vlog so all these things that I'm doing Charlie is I draw in your thing and Takashi that I'm using so after I did a consultation for the allergies and was given and some medication I'm supposed to go and take it at the pharmacy um, I expressed that I would want to get a photochromic glasses okay because I own one um, I've owned it for like two years now and I, I'm on insurance so why not um, if I'm not paying for it I can get another one so since I was already at the optician um, I wanted to take advantage of that to get another photochromic glasses okay i was directed to go and see i think an optician i guess to do the assessment and whatnot i went to him and i wanted to video the process and he told me that he wouldn't want to be but i asked him politely um can i document the process because i want to take a video and he told me he told me he wasn't comfortable with that okay and i was trying to persuade him but he kept saying his hand he was giving excuses fair enough he doesn't want to come in the video and i respected that so i didn't put on 
my video i just uh, went we just went about the process and that was this i left then i was going into the showroom for the glasses so then i was excited that's that should be the fun part where you go in there and then you try on different lenses different glasses okay for your lens guys I was just videoing the entrance okay so obviously because I had turned the camera and I was videoing the entrance of the showroom when I opened the door obviously my camera was on whoever was at the opposite end okay and I don't know you from anywhere you don't work there so tell me why I would be videoing you for what reason like what exactly you are not a star why would i want to put you in my video for you know and for me i made that conscious effort right if you have to come in i will ask you politely and i don't go around videoing random people for my video so immediately i entered this woman oh it was for me night crazy inside name you may be a gate now so i think they could see me from you know it's that glass like they can see you from the inside but you can't see them unless you enter okay so they could see me they had already seen me coming in with the camera and i am guessing they had some conversations about it because in yano me drew inside like men do inside me be a gate here me nine see moi hey why are you videoing me i don't want to come in i hope you are not videoing me i don't want to i'm like please you are not in my video i make a conscious effort not to video people i don't know and she was like and eh, but your camera is turned this way it's facing me so and i said but you are not in my video guys ehonuma all the excitement and the happiness from gone i i was really angry when i was trying on the glasses and you know it, it took the excitement and the fun out of the whole thing like seriously genuinely she she didn't even she, she didn't even come like i didn't even get the opportunity to video Mpo for her to come inside you get it she doesn't even work there and i don't get it it's like she had come to visit her friend who is the receptionist and they just went on having their conversation the the receptionist totally ignored me sure that so after i selected the glasses then i went to i said which one do you think looks better on me and she's like oh you have to wear both of them i wore the second one she's like this one look better i went back and they were like my insurance does not cover all the costs i have to top i said top up way i went back to LA. i'm like you know what let's just forget about this photochromic um, glasses plus there's a place in la paz there's an optician there and my previous employment i used to go there with my colleague the card was always enough to cover the entire cost they explained to me that the glasses is 450 and then the cost of the lens itself is 480 so 930 and my insurance covers 700 i have to top up 30 so i wasn't interested the first receptionist and the staff there they were extremely nice to me i called them before i settled because when i watched the time it was two o'clock and i was getting irritated i was thinking ah could i get an optician around this time like you know i've wasted the whole day instead of me going to the hospital i was just lying around lazing about because i'm i'm really tired charlie i'm i'm really really tired to be honest on this particular day i feel very worn out and my eyes and i woke up this morning um i had to close my eyes for like you know some seconds before i could open my eyes and then my ear my ear loop everywhere is itchy do you understand uh-huh so i was just you know thinking oh it will go it's probably because i just woke up but it was getting worse but when i called when i googled um and i got the contact and i called the person that took the call it's very nice i asked so should i come she's like we are about i said i beg i'm not feeling well i i'm getting irritated she was nice she was like oh come in oh look at it. and when i went there they were all nice all of them i think there was one at the pharmacy the reception and then the person that was in charge of the card and whatnot that's the person that took the call she was very nice and then even after when i had to check whether my 
um card can cover the entire course she was there ex she was the one that actually explained to me blah 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 i told her oh it seems your prices are high because this other place i go to our card always covers everything and then she was trying to convince me to go and get a cheaper option and she was like i waited for you and wanted she was very nice so um left with her alone i would have gone back to do but it, when i look at the reception i got at the other side i don't want to go and do that you know explain to her this is not you know it's not an emergency it's not um it's not a need right now it's just that i want to because i have the opportunity but you know i can do without it it's not an emergency if i don't do it nothing will happen the most important thing is what i came for which i was giving um medication for that is the allergies you know i got three different medicines so um if i have to add up then i don't want it again so at the end he understood where i'm currently taking it off so we are not ready to splurge on things that we can you know do later or get for free so basically that's what happened i'm at um new star ear center i'm at the ent um i want to see if i can wash my ear loops actually my allergies is getting worse and i need to act asap so um yeah come with me and i don't know if i can vlog this this woman has killed all the excitement and the energy i had like seriously it's not easy walking around with a camera you know sometimes the way people behave and you know some comments people pass it's just a turn off okay like what i just experienced now but we move let's see how this goes gotcha good afternoon hey uh, are you still working yes sir. okay great i've been here before So guys we are done but as you can see the quality of the video has dropped because the original phone i used to vlog went off in the middle of the process so um i had to use another phone which had um less video quality compared to the one i used but basically we are done here i have to get ready for the end of year party at the office so i'm going to get dressed and then go back to accra hey guys good evening so i'm in the traffic i'm trying to get to the office now i said i'll leave the house around five but because of everything I had to do um, before leaving, uh, I'm quite late. Yeah, but health is always important. You have to prioritize your health first before any other thing. So um, there's a little traffic on the hospital road, but I believe I should get to the office before 7 p.m. Well, it's currently 640 
well, seven, seven, ten, thereabouts. <laughs> All right, so come along with me to the end of year party. I'll see you at the party. Uh, I hope I'm looking pretty. This was a quick fix, um, but I guess it's good enough. Today has been quite a day. I struggled through the day, so... <laughs> Um, yeah, I'll see you later. Where's my song? Okay, okay, find this. Yeah. I beg, take take a video for me. Are you serious? Last someone. Because Yeah, yeah, yeah. 